20 years of my life I spent with a man that loved me more, made me feel more loved than I'd ever felt in my entire life. Now at five, a final farewell. He died in the line of duty, and today hundreds lined the streets to give this firefighter a hero's goodbye. Good evening to you. Scott Davis died last week as he fought a big church fire in Muncie. And today his funeral brought out hundreds of people from across the country. News Channel 15's Aisha Husney has our top story. And Aisha, there were a lot of Fort Wayne firefighters there too. That's right, Heather. About 40 of our guys took a bus down to Muncie today. This was really important to them. And they'll tell you, being a firefighter is like being a part of a brotherhood. So it just made sense to be at this funeral in person. Something very appreciated by Davis's family. Davis died while battling a fire at the Tabernacle of Praise Church in Muncie. The fire ripped through the roof of the church's sanctuary before it collapsed on top of him. This is a bird's eye view of the procession today. A fire truck carried his casket through Muncie. His family walked closely behind. Davis was a veteran member of the Muncie Fire Department. He was married and had three children. His widow spoke at, the, at today's service. I didn't know the meaning of brotherhood and sisterhood until Tom and Vicki and I stood in this line and watched all of you walk through here as a brother and a sister to Scott. Scott was an only child, and uh, you've proven today that that's a false statement. Church leaders there say their rebuilding plans include a permanent memorial for the firefighter. Investigators are still trying to figure out what caused that fire. And coming up at 6 o'clock, we'll show you more of that procession and tell you what's helping his family get through this tragedy. In Studio 15 tonight, I'm Aisha Hasni, News Channel 15.